yeah i'm just over at bd4 now uh for the contractor we do a bit for outside davy textiles it's literally at the back of me here it's going down there a bit of a ginnel there um alleyway ginnel snick it <laughs> whatever you call it from wherever you're from in fact put in the comments what do you call it from where you're from um i call it an alley but Good morning, start for another fine week here at Airedale, Monday, 7am, not a bad day today, I think it's forecast rain tomorrow but today's looking alright, um, just got to get along and have a bit, I'm just going to catch up for a couple of hours, lads are just turning up now, I've just heard them, um, we'll get loaded up there back at Thornton School, I think Justin's got a domestic job to see and I'm meeting Matt over at Batlater School to build a gate automation access control, what's doing there. Let him have a look because it's literally right in the other school where power's got to go. Uh, so we'll see the best way to get it through the school and a lot of trenching. I've already priced a lot of gates and fencing up a little bit. So yeah, I think at 10 a.m. I'm meeting Matt there. So yeah, busy, busy week and we'll see you later and we'll get some footage as we go along. Alright, so we're at Thornton School. Uh, just lads have been on it. I were off a couple of days last week on a training course, so just having a look. They've uh, been smashing 60 metres a day out, so Maggie's just going get in the line now. So it's reset up down there. And as you can see, it goes all the way up. We're actually doing this whole field. Um, so once we're at the end, we'll have a count up. Gap up there where a gate's going, and I believe there's a gate going further down. I'm actually going to get caretaker out in a second and just reconfirm where all these gates are going. Got up materials and stuff, Jamie's just gonna barrow some down now. I'm gonna go all the way down. Goes all the way down there. But we're still at it. We don't stop no matter rain, pour, sunshine, snow. But we're still at it. We don't stop no matter rain, pour, sunshine, snow. We just carry on. Don't we Jamie? Don't we Jamie? Always. So yeah, we'll uh, get cracked on and uh, off we pop. Hey, uh, yeah, so I just back at yard. Uh, I've just been to Battle meeting Matt. I just uh, a job of pricing at a school there. Uh, they want loads of the automation access control, but uh, a lot of digging out needed, trenching for the cables and stuff. About 200 metres, I think, all in all. It's quite a, quite a big job to do there. Um, might not come off all Christmas, he's told us, because they're changing to an academy. Um, hence why they want all these works doing potentially some CCTV works as well so it's a good job for Matt but there's a lot of fencing works for us as well so yeah um, hopefully should be a good one but uh, yeah I'm just back at yard we just had a bit of an email little job we did over at Skimpton yeah it's just slightly dropped so Justin's just gonna go over now I'm just giving him his, uh, his new toolbox so he's getting all that together I'm getting his toolbox together in here, look, I don't know if you can see him. Okay, uh, <laughs> new toolbox. Let's get my first aid kit so together as well. No, now he's a site supervisor, he passed, well done by the way, Justin. He passed that last week, two day course, he were on site first, supervisors. First timer in everything I do around First timer, here. didn't bad. 96%, can't grumble with that. Um, not bad for a big thick turd, is it? <laughs> <laughs> well, I see you pass it. I did pass it. Yeah, 25 years ago. So no, it was about 10 years ago. But I, I've actually life, done a, a site manager's one, which is five days. That's mind-boggling compared to his. Um, so yeah, he's just getting his tools there and uh, drills and some batteries, and he's just going to go over and sort them gates out. It should be just a trustable spanner job. But uh, so he's now commandeered my old truck. There, uh, he loves it. Driving around, supervising now, thinks he wants bless. So, lads are just cracking on this side now, coming down. They're going to tie it on to where they've been going. Absolutely boiling today. Uh, just digging two holes at a time. So today's job, go down there and tie it into the existing. They've already put in 227 metres from, oh, you see that 
ivies all the way up to the top we've got this bit to go and then all the way up to the top of there and then we're on the actual football pitch itself we're actually putting in some rebound mesh in there so yeah um, another I'd say with that rebound another five days on this job not the floor missing anywhere so oh, it's looking good it's basically there's a gate in there as well there's going to be a gate down the bottom here just in case balls go over they can always get in and out up this side it'll be all same 2.4i um, v mesh and then where we actually come in and out there's a gate just on there uh, there'll be a double gate there for vehicle access good morning over in Morley and uh, Leeds, uh, I've just come to uh, the Ocean Gates. They've actually, you can see that pillar in the background there. Gates have actually come off the hinges here. Um, and I know why. Um, I think originally they've had steel frames and then they've, uh, they've cladded them in uh, wood. You can see them on the floor there. They're far too heavy to be off these pillars. So obviously the uh, Winds caught them and then took took the pillars down, so that'll need rebuilding. But I'm going to suggest they don't have the timber. I mean, I know it's for privacy, but it's just too heavy for this span here. It's six meter span along here. Again, they've added this net into it, so the wind's not coming through as it's designed, and then they wonder why the posts have come over. So yeah, I'll have to um, quote for reconcreting them in, but that's that's why things are designed a certain way and then people add to them and then they wonder why they come down in the wind so yeah I'll, uh, I'll get this one measured up and sorted out and I'll uh, next one's over in Hoosfield so I'll see you there Hi there, yeah, so I'm just over in Huddersfield actually, it's just a um, bit of a car park for the, um, the main mosque is there actually for the guys. Um, this is Huddersfield car park and it's fairly busy, but basically they're after it fencing along the front and all up the side there, there's uh, 75, 80 metres in total. Um, and allowed, they've got permission for two metre high mesh and there's a couple of bits out back we get so I shall uh, get back and get this quoted up and hopefully should hear good things with this one. Just uh, finishing up for the day now, just getting the last one in. Obviously got this section here to go here just to join up. That's all the way up there. It's uh, not been a bad day, it's actually just calmed down. Clouds are coming out and the sun's gone away for a bit. Otherwise they'll end up uh, with a right tan over here. That's just to mark where they started today, so been all that, they've done all that, and they've went to the other side as well. It's not looking bad. I reckon Tuesday, Wednesday next week it should all be in. I've been here for a week now and a couple of days. The lads have uh, just left them, come back, they have already got gate in, joined it up there. It looks like a panel and a half. Going all the way up here. Good morning everyone, hope you can see me well. Sun shining again. Uh... Yeah, the lads are back over at Thornton today. Um, they're cracking on really good day. I might get a chance to call in actually after my appointments. Uh, I'm just setting off now to uh, BD8 to be showing the client. Told them I'll be about 15 minutes. He's got some land there while he's fencing off. Um, and then um, I'm over at a job in BD4, just off uh, Tong Street, I believe, for a customer we do some work for. Um, so I'll see that one. And then I've got a, a school to price. He sent me a video. I've, we've done work there before, so I know the job. Ten, part of a tennis court to uh, refence. So yeah, busy day. So like I said, I'll try and get some footage as I go on, but it's a bit awkward sometimes, especially with schools and whatnot. So yeah, so as I've said earlier, a bit awkward. Uh, the last job I went to in Manningham, there were sort of three or four of them there. A bit awkward to start filming. Uh, especially when they don't really want to be on YouTube. So um, yeah, I'm just over at BD4 now uh, for the contractor we do a bit for outside Davy Textiles. It's literally at the back of me here. It's going down uh, a bit of a ginnel there. Um, alleyway ginnel, 
Snick it. <laughs> whatever you call it from wherever you're from. In fact, put in the comments what do you call it from where you're from. Um, I call it an Alice, but uh, I think in Bradford they call it a Ginnell and Snick it, whatever. I don't know. Let me know in the comments what you think. But yeah, just like six sections of Palisade to go down and snick it down here. So it's already a gimmick job, really. We just I hadn't seen it, so I thought I'd better have a, a glance at it before we do it. So I think I've actually maybe got the stock for that, so I'll have a look when I get back to the yard. So yeah, I'm just going to make my way back to the yard now and get these jobs quoted out that I've seen earlier. And I'll catch you later. Uh, so, back at Thornton School here. I've been here for a week now and a couple of days. Lads have uh, just left them, come back, I've already got gating, join it up there. It looks like a panel and a half. Going all the way up here. I've just got here now. All the way up there, it's done. And then as you can see, once we get this little section done, they already did all this part here. So, I'm gonna, basically we'll probably end up going up there and then coming down there today. And then that there. Oh, good afternoon guys. Friday afternoon holiday. Sun comes around every week, doesn't it? Uh, just, sorry I haven't had time today doing any filming. I've just been that busy in office sorting stuff out, doing rams and quotes and admin and all that lovely stuff and uh, I've been with Matt for an hour he's been doing loads of quotes for a school that we went to see with access control CCTV gear yeah, automation so yeah we've sent them over all good in the hood uh, so yeah hopefully the lads have got some good footage of what they've been doing this week at Beckfoot Thornton I think they have um, hopefully you'd have seen that in this video so yeah I shall call it at that and that should do for this week and uh, whilst you're here why not give us a like or in fact subscribe down below and we'll see you next time thank you